I imagine we all know that Jesus came to earth to die for our sins. Hopefully, we also understand that he had to become human and take on flesh to accomplish that task, but have we ever thought about why that was necessary? The edict goes all the way back to the Garden of Eden. God warned Adam and Eve that the price for their disobedience would be death. We see this truth in many places throughout the scriptures, like in Romans 6.23, which tells us that our sin earns us death. But why is this the case? The answer is found in Leviticus 17, verse 11. For the life of a creature is in the blood, and I have given it to you to make atonement for yourselves on the altar. It is the blood that makes atonement for one's life. Our life is in our blood, therefore blood must be shed, and a life is required as punishment for sin. That is the whole point of the sacrificial system found in the Old Testament. Animals needed to be slaughtered and their blood placed on the altar to forgive sins. That practice was also prophetical as it pointed to the perfect Lamb of God who would die on a cross and shed his blood for us once for all. May we be thankful that Jesus took on flesh and blood and was willing to die in our place and reach out and receive the gift of salvation that he offers.